and I hope you are having a fantastic day and I hope you are having a relatively stress-free December. If you are not, this video is for you. So whilst I was planning my December content for little old Layla Land, um, are my lights on? Yes, they are. <gasps> I thought my fairy lights weren't switched on then for a horrific moment. Okay, stand down. Um, yeah, whilst I was planning my December content for you lovely bunch, um, I really was trying to think of what would be useful. So I do things like my gift guides, I do things that um, I feel like you lot will enjoy. And one of the things that I really try to um, be mindful of and keep in mind are my viewers who are um, with me on the social anxiety front and and think about other mums in my position who are busy and um, I try to think as well about the people who don't like Christmas uh, for whatever reason, um, who just don't find it a happy time or an exciting time or um, just want it to be over as quickly as possible, um, which is fine. Nobody is... Um, obliged to be enjoying this time of year at all it's cold it's dark it's usually raining um so i get it i get it it's fine um but even for people like me who are um you know i am the epitome of little miss christmas i love christmas i spend all year looking forward to christmas planning for christmas thinking about christmas um trying to beat last christmas trying to make it bigger and better um but i do get myself in a bit of a tiz about it which if you're following me on vlogmas or on layla land extra you will be going through the tiz currently um so i know that uh, december the run-up to christmas and winter in general can be a very very low time for a lot of people it can be a very stressful busy time for a lot of people so i wanted to make a video that encouraged as many of you as possible to just take a minute and um spend some time on yourself and take some self-care time um, i'm just going to take my makeup off i'm going to remove my eye makeup i'm going to double cleanse my face and then i'm going to use one of these lovely face masks which i have had waiting for this video for weeks and i've been so excited to use them so i wanted to find um some festive themed face masks and i ended up finding like six which is a little excessive just for one video but i wanted to share them with you in case you wanted to get them as gifts or you wanted to get them for yourself um they are all by the mask bar which is my current favorite obsession with face masks because as i've mentioned before i am a sucker for a novelty item a novelty packaging i love it i love a themed item so the first one is this really cute Christmas mitten. Just look how cute and festive that is. I'm gonna hold it. There we go. That's not shining on you too much, is it? So this one is the Mask Bar Self-Heating Mud Mask. So charcoal self-heating mud mask helps to detoxify and smoothens. It contains charcoal powder, so that's wonderful. If you are um, kind of breaking out or you're a bit oily, then this is really good for that. <gasps> look at this one. <laughs> look at him. How cute is he? So we've got the little gingerbread person and this is the gingerbread cookie cream mask. Uh, illuminates and helps to firm. This has got cinnamon extract in it. So I bet this smells properly Christmas, eh? Love it. Um, I got this one as well. I'm pretty sure it's by the same, like the parent brand of the mask bar. So it says on the back it's by Look Beauty, which is the parent company of the mask bar. So but it doesn't say mask bar on the front of it. So I'm not sure, could you help me out mask bar people? Um, but this is the candy cane cream mask, which just sounds wonderful. Uh, it says cleanses, refines, purifies, um, contains peppermint leaf extract, sugar maple extract, and citrus extract. So this sounds absolutely magical. Um, I bet this would be good for Charlotte actually. I might see if Charlotte wants to use that one. Um, so they are all kind of um, cream masks. Then I got three sheet masks as well, or tissue masks, which I am very excited for because I think they've got the animals on the actual mask. Very excited. So the first one I've got is the penguin one. And if you look there, I think that is what the sheet 
looks like. So I'm very excited to turn myself potentially into a penguin. So this one says purifying sheet mask. Contains lily flower, grapefruit uh, and mulberry. Then we've got the polar bear one. Look at him. He's so cute with his little ear muffs on. Um, look. look, you get to turn yourself into a polar bear. Such cute. I like that. Um, this one again says purifying. No, it doesn't. This one says nourishing. Honeysuckle, turmeric and grapefruit. I believe turmeric is really good for your skin. Oh, uh, provides intensive hydration to calm the skin with soothing properties. Ooh, so if you're having a bit of a stressed, irritated skin time, that would be really good for that one. Are you ready for this one? Then we've got the little reindeer one. He's got beautiful earmuffs on too. Has the penguin got earmuffs on? Oh, they've all got earmuffs on. They're so cute. Um, right, so this is the reindeer calming sheet mask uh, with witch hazel, fruit extract and bee glue. Oh, witch hazel is really good for kind of, um, if you've got breakouts, they're really, really healing. It's like naturally healing. So this one says, provides intensive hydration to calm the skin again. Yep, okay, the leak thought. Marvellous. Right, so I don't know which one I'm gonna use. <laughs> I think I might use the charcoal one because they're a hum, a hum. I am getting a few little breakouts down here and I don't know if you can tell, I've got to the end of the day uh, makeup wise and I've got a little bit shiny and oily. So maybe a charcoal one to kind of balance that out and then maybe one of the sheet masks um, as a bit of a like intense injection of serum as well um, to be extra nourishing and wonderful. So, First things first, I need to remove my makeup. So I'm gonna go in with the usual suspects if you've seen any of my Instagram videos. Um, so I'm gonna go in, first of all, with um, the simple Dual Effect Eye Makeup Remover, which is my favorite. Then I'm gonna go in with the number seven Cleansing Balm. Then I'm gonna go in with the number seven Oil. What's it called? Um, just Cleansing Oil, which I love. Um, and then I will crack on with the face masks. So bear with while I just take my makeup off and we'll go from there. Okay? Okay. If my skin looks a little red, nobody panic. I always get messages when I do a skincare video and my skin goes red. It does it with water. It's allergic to water. So just don't panic. I think I am going to go for this one. Oh, I don't Yeah, I feel like it's a bit clogged up at the, at the skin. It At the minute is my skin. Mm -hmm. It's been a long day. Um, So I think I'm going to use the one in the little cute festive mitten um which is the charcoal self-heating one um so yeah let's apply him shall we oh it's gray i thought it was gonna be black so i'm just gonna oh it smells lovely oh that's got a really nice light fragrance to it um that just smells really fresh and nice and it actually feels really smooth and nice doesn't feel sticky I think some uh, clay masks or cream masks can feel a little gloopy and sticky. This does not feel like that at all. It's got a really nice texture to it. I love the warming aspect of it as well. I've no idea if it actually works on a skincare level. I think the idea of it is um, to kind of, the heat is meant to like open up your pores and the mask can get in and do more. No idea how true or effective that is in the slightest. But in terms of like a nice experience as a user, as a consumer, lovely. Very nice. I'm already feeling the stress leave my body. I always get some under my eyebrow and then I spend the rest of the time really paranoid it's going to drip into my eye so I'll just clean that up. Oh, right, that's me with my face mask on. Um, I think now what I'm going to do is just watch a movie with the kids and just chill out for a little bit and then come back and do the rest of my skincare and hopefully by then I'll have just had half an hour, an hour to myself and I've just decompressed a little bit and de-stressed a little bit. Um, so I hope you're joining along with me and you've gone and got your little face mask on or you're doing whatever it is you do to relax. If you want to see what goes on during these moments where I'm off camera doing the whole chilling out and having my face mask on, go over to um, Layla Land Extra, which is where my vlogs are, um, and look for Vlogmas Day 10. Okay, but for you, I'll be back in a second. For me, I'll be back in about half an hour. Ta-da! 
I am back in the room. Um, I did have to go and uh, wash off the face mask though <laughs> uh, before I came back to filming because it was kind of dripping and running and, and, and things. So that was the only thing that I felt about that one. It was just a little bit, I had to be a little bit sort of look back and careful because it did run and drip and it's kind of gone on my uh, dressing gown. So that's going to need washing now. Um, but uh, it felt beautiful on my skin. Uh, I love the warming feature of it as well. Um, Charlotte did use the reindeer sheet mask, uh, but she's gone to bed now. Loved it. Um, Charlotte's uh, skin, let me just let the cat out. Um, Charlotte's skin can get quite uh, sensitive and irritated very quickly. And I did notice that when she took it off, there was no redness. Um, we both can sometimes get it where you can kind of see the outline of the mask that we've put on, but I didn't notice any of that. So it looked like a really comfortable, nice, nourishing, non-irritating um, mask to use. So yes, I will confirm with her in the morning. Um, but yeah, mine was absolutely gorgeous. So I'm just going to continue and just uh, clean my face. So because I used because I used the cream mask and not the sheet mask, I will go in with my toner. If you're using a sheet mask, don't bother using a toner afterwards. Um, just kind of remove the mask, massage in any um, serum that's left over and you don't need to use a toner afterwards because then you're just taking off all the stuff that the mask has just put in. Um, but if you're using a clear mask or a cream mask, any kind of mask that you need to wash off, um, obviously you're fine to use a toner. So, uh, if anybody is interested, that was my simple facial toner, 100% alcohol free, which is what we want in our skincare. We don't need alcohol in our skincare, thank you, because it dries it out. I'm going to go in with my eye cream first, and I'm still absolutely obsessed with the vitamin C one from Boots. Loving it. Then I'm going to go in with the Mud Mask it After Mask Vitamin Serum, which I kind of figured was a bit gimmicky, but I do like it as a serum, so... So there we go. While Leonard's having a scratch, I'm going to use my vitamin C serum from Revolution. And he's back in the room. That one went wrong. <laughs> because it's night time and I'm not going out in the sun, um, I do live in East Lancashire, so when do I? I'm using my vitamin C gel cream as well. If it was the daytime and I've been using my vitamin C products, I would use a different moisturiser with an SPF in it just to protect it a little bit um, in case it's a little bit sensitive after using the vitamin C. But as soon as it's night time and that ain't a problem, I'm going to use the vitamin C cream gel as well. So I really hope you've enjoyed this. I hope it has reminded you to um, not let the hustle and bustle of December and Christmas get on top of you. I hope it's allowed you to remember that you don't even have to be a part of the hustle and bustle of Christmas if you don't want to. Um, and I hope you've enjoyed just having a little hoogly evening with me and I've had fun having a hoogly evening with you. Um, yes very much looking forward to powering through the rest of those face masks for the next two weeks because as i am filming this video it's two weeks till christmas eve and i'm very excited um so yes um go and check out my other videos on layla land extra where i'm doing vlogmas and i'm very much enjoying it even though the last two videos have been basically me just having a mental breakdown there we go that's just how it goes um so yeah i hope you like this one if you have make sure you give it a big thumbs up please make sure you're subscribed down below hit the little bell icon and you'll be notified every single time i post a video um come and say hello as well in the comments or on social media i love hearing from you and i will see you in my next video please take care of yourself i love you very much bye